Hi YouTube, I am back to do a update on my full lace wig from misswigs.com. Um, I had this wig since February and my last video was about how I ombre it with this ombre kit by L'Oreal. As you can see the hair is a lot lighter because I, I dyed it. I used bleach developer, the powder bleach and developer. Um, it's my first time bleaching my hair, so it probably looks a little uneven, but I tried my best to mix it in to make it look natural or whatever. But, oh well, it looks better than how it did before. Something different, you know. Um, the hair has been holding up excellent, as always. Always excellent. I had this hair before, this wig before, and it was, it was excellent. No shedding, no tangling, no stress. Just stress-free. Um, the wig is glueless, so I don't glue it down. And I don't wear it to sleep. I can just take it off, put it back on uh, when I'm done. <laughs> so it's going to last a lot longer uh, since I don't sleep in it. But I'm bored. Again, I'm bored, so I may be dyeing the hair back to a, a darker color, maybe black again, just, you know, because I'm, I'm just bored. I'm bored of brown. I'm bored of this whole ombre thing, but it came out really nice. Like, everyone complimented the hair. They they love this on me. I never had anything light like this before, and I never thought I could pull it off because it's just not me. Like, it just looked too... I don't know, too Philadelphia, too Philly, because everybody in Philly has this ombre thing, and it's always, like, real ghetto looking, just at the tips, but I don't know. I think I did a good job, but I want something different. Um, what are the most important things that you need to know about the wig? That was pretty much it, that it doesn't tangle, it doesn't shed, and yeah, it takes the fucking dye really good. That means that this is good hair. That's, it's virgin hair. It's virgin hair, definitely. Because it took this hair, and I left the hair on for, what, 45 to 60 minutes? And these are the results. Um, as you can see, the hair moves. It's still healthy. It's not all stiff. Um, it's just, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It looks like a completely different wig. It really does. But it's not. It's the same wig. So if you are interested in purchasing this or you already have this unit, all you need to know is that it's 100% virgin. It is good hair. And I will be purchasing this again. But the only thing I don't really um, care for is the fact that it's only available in um, 14 inches to 20 and this is 18, and I'm kind of bored of the 18-inch look. I want to try a mermaid look. I want long hair. I want the long hair, you know. So uh, they don't offer a wig um, in any inches beyond 20. So I've been looking for bundles of hair instead in a closure that I can rock during the summer. Because I can't wear a wig to the beach. And I'm not wearing my real hair. Because that salt water ain't touching my hair. Nope. Um, so I want to wear uh, a closure. And some virgin bundles or whatever. But the only problem is that I can't find a vendor that sells legit virgin hair. I've researched. I reviewed. And majority of the ones that I've found have been bad. Always bad reviews, bad companies. And um, the gurus, they're making me sick because they receive the hair for free. So you can't really buy the hair based on their review because, you know, half the time, it, you know, they've received better hair than the actual customers. And they keep reviewing different hair companies. So it's just like, what happened to the hair from this company? And then what happened to the hair from that company? And then you get confused, like... Should I buy the hair or what? Because she didn't buy it. She got it for free. So is it really good hair? So now I'm like trying to find a vendor that is legit. That is worth spending my hard earned money on. And that's why I make my units last. So 
if you know any vendors that are selling um, legit virgin hair, you know, leave it in my inbox or you can put it on the links below. I'll say links below. Just leave it on a comment if you know a legit vendor from, you know, Alibaba, AliExpress, however you say that, or a, a company in general. Um, but if I see a YouTube guru's face promoting the company, I'm running away as far away as possible because that means to me, waste of money. So that's pretty much it. I will be doing another update soon. Don't know when, but soon. When the time is right. Um, so, thank you for watching. Like I said, comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, any information about the hair will be left in the link box or whatever. The description box below. Bye.